Sierra Thompson, and I played Serena for Surviving the Undead Season 1. I like Season 1 partially because there is um, a lot of family-based stuff in it. You know, it's, you know, there are a lot of families nowadays that are very conflicted and don't always get along, and, and that's really sad, you know, in a lot of ways. And so this was, you know, kind of putting it in the public's face of, hey, this stuff still happens. You know, there's parents that aren't talking to their kids and vice versa, and, and kids not getting along. You know, it's like you're supposed to love your siblings and help them out, not, you know, put them down. And with season two, you know, it should, you know, now that we know what to expect, you know, we're, you know, we have grander ideas for it, and, you know, hopefully everything, you know, will go good. You know, especially we have, you know, some new talent, you know, some old talent, you know, good cast and crew. You know, and hopefully everything would turn out good. You know, I'm, I'm pretty excited too, you know, just from a, hey, I'm not going to be in it, but I want to see what happens, you know, see what other energy and, you know, everybody else's own talent that they can put into it, you know, that's different from season one. So. Season one was really difficult in a lot of ways just because um, there were things that we didn't maybe expect that would happen. Oh, we need, you know, a little bit extra money for this time, you know, rental equipment, whatever. Every, you know, season when people are watching Walking Dead, you know, they're like, oh, what's Daryl gonna do this time, you know? They're, they're looking for the next thing, and so with this, you know, it's like they have more characters to look forward to. Maybe they'll die, maybe they won't. You just gotta stay tuned and find out. <laughs> Did you learn a lot? Yeah, actually I did. You know, you, you learn how much effort and time is put into it. You know, not just from the actors, but from everybody, the director, you know, staying up all night editing, you know, night after night for, you know, hours, you know. Some people put in 18 hour shifts at the oil field, you know. Directors, you know, have their own problems and, and stuff they have to deal with, you know, people walking out on them, whatever. And so it's like you get a little bit more appreciation for the extra features, not just, oh, the actors like the same person I do. It's like, no, it's like everybody behind the scenes matters too.